Mario, Princess yeah. Peach, and Luigi. Looks like Mario fans have a lot of games to cool. look forward to. More details will be shared in the future. All right, Mario let's fans see are some more headlines. Become Gotham City's ultimate protector. What is this? Oh! Wake up, oh. Mystery. <laughs> we have much to discuss. Yo, they had me for a second! you to know the fear that is coming. They're bringing the Arkham games! Oh, that's sick! for you, Dark Knight. You're all going down. That's sick! Oh my god, I cannot wait! Oh my god, I am absolutely- I'll use any excuse to play the Arkham games again, man. Wow, the Arkham game's so coming to Switch. That score! Oh yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm getting into this. Coming to Nintendo Switch! The first two games I can see running on Switch. I don't know how they're gonna get Arkham Knight to run on Switch. Oh, all the DLC too! I believe that was the idea. Whoa. That's a really good package, actually. All the DLC? Yeah, that, there's the Arkham City DLC. Oh, that score! Oh, man. It still gets me so hyped. You're always welcome here. Oh, man. Batman Arkham Trilogy. Oh, man. Gameplay footage not final. This fall. This fall. Play your cards right. Oh, I miss Kevin Conroy, man. I miss Major Kevin Conroy, man. Dungeons in the lands of Gloomhaven. That was great. Okay, the, the direct is over, but I had to go back. Oh, man. This this made me really happy. I didn't even expect that there was going to be anything during this Nintendo Direct that was going to be for me. But I always just... I wanted to record my reaction just in case. I mean, you never know. Like, last time during the Game Awards, we got that Marvel Ultimate Alliance 3 reveal. That was exclusive to the Switch. You never know what Nintendo's got in store for us. And I definitely wasn't going to expect that the Batman Arkham games were going to be coming to the Switch. When I saw that Batman art, I honestly thought for a second there, you know, similar to like what I just said with Marvel's Capcom 3, that there was going to be like a Batman Switch game. Which, I mean, I would have been all over that, don't get me wrong. But this makes me just as happy hearing again, of course, Kevin Conroy's Batman. Hearing that score, Rocksteady just, I mean... I don't know if there will be a gaming trilogy that means as much to me as the Arkham games did. Um, but honestly as well, I am kind of sad that we don't got Arkham Origins on Switch as well, man. I mean, Arkham Origins is just that forgotten child of the Arkham franchise, and it really it makes me sad. I think that people should recognize how good Arkham Origins is, honestly. But yo, that key art is sick. I need that in HD. You know, I need the full image. My desktop background is dying for it. That was incredible. I am so glad that the Batman Arkham games are coming to the Switch. I'm sure that's really exciting for a lot of people who haven't been able to get a chance to play them yet or would like to play them on the go. Here's hoping at least though, that it's not the cloud version and that it's an actual Switch port of the games. But again, I have no idea what they're planning to do with Arkham Knight and getting that to run on the Switch. Arkham Asylum, Arkham City, I think they're small enough to get it to work. And obviously they're a lot older. You know, they were games that were available on the 360 and the PlayStation 3. So I think, you know, graphically they can work for the Nintendo Switch. Arkham Knight though, even to today's standards, is one of the best looking games and best performing games that I've ever seen in the superhero gaming genre, maybe even in general. So I don't know what they're gonna do for the Switch port here. But hey, um, if that caught you by surprise just as much as it did me, hit the thumbs up button on this reaction. And with that being said, let me know what you guys think of the Batman Arkham Trilogy coming to Nintendo Switch in the comments section below. I've been Caboose. And I'll see you guys later.